are hearing from the family of a woman who was shot to death. Police believe an acquaintance killed Dixie Shira, then attempted to cover up that crime. It took months for the officer to charge John Kolkman, but despite his arrest, Dixie Shira's family is still struggling. News 4's Michaela Simmons joins us with that family and shares their tragic and heartbreaking story. Good evening, Michaela. Good evening, Bela. They say Dixie was friendly and would give anyone anything because she had a heart of gold. She was the most caring, outgoing, um, always wanted to be a part of everything. Dixie Shira was tragically killed last October at a Dothan home. It first appears she took her own life, but police say something was not adding up. So they took a hard look and charged John Allen Kochman with manslaughter. Amy Mahan is Dixie's mother, and she vividly learns that her daughter's life had been cut short. Monday morning, we had a discussion. I was like, something's not right. So when I got the call from the detective, I, I'll be honest, I, I couldn't breathe. It was like somebody reached inside me and just pulled out my soul. Dixie Shira was a 28 year old mother of two. People knew her most from working at Waffle House. There, she made new friends with a magnetic personality. And then there was her adventurous side. Dixie wanted to start shooting, so I started off with a little BB gun, and we were shooting targets 25, 30 feet. Um, then it graduated up to a 22 caliber, and then on, on up into the larger, larger weapons that I have. Um, he says being around Dixie was like being around a light, a beacon of joy. Jimmy Shirer won't forget being around Dixie and her two sisters. I, I taught them all how to drive. And, uh, well, I give them a little truck and say, go through the woods, learn how to drive it. You know, and they did. Um, but I'd be in there with them sometimes and they'd hit trees and stuff. And it was all out in the woods, you know. The investigation into Dixie's death is ongoing and police don't rule out other charges. Um, I, I want to know how, how Dixie ended up with, at this house with these people. Uh, I want to know if they're not her normal friends. They're not the type. Um, I want to know, did he pray on my daughter? Now as for her accused killer, John Kochman, he's in jail under a $1.5 million bond. Shira's family says they are thankful for the work done by Dothan Police and lead investigator Terry Nelson. Bela. Michaela Simmons, thank you so much for that report.